Icy Whiskey here with a terrific device here from Icy Dock, the Black Vortex. We're talking about a quad bay external hard drive enclosure for three and a half inch hard drives. Okay, so up to four hard drives in here, and uh, each hard drive can be up to eight terabytes in size for latest and greatest technology. As you can see here, these are the main highlights. It's going to support USB 3.0 and eSATA, obviously. Uh, this is for SATA hard drives, just so you know. Comes with a nice blue LED fan, which you can control the speeds on. But the, the beautiful thing about it is what you can use this for. Expanding your storage, whether it's on your PC, on your Mac, a home server. Maybe you've got a media center. Maybe you want to just plug it into the back of your wireless uh, router. A lot of routers today have the capability to plug in eSATA and USB 3.0 at the back. Terrific. Why not use that and have a standard storage area? Maybe you want to put all your movies and everything on it and then access it wirelessly through your devices at home. Why not? There are the cables for the USB 3.0 and eSATA, and there is the power adapter, of course, that you would uh, need to attach it to. Possibilities, like I said, are endless, but let's take a quick look here at the high-low uh, options for the uh, LED and the airflow coming in through this vortex, this black vortex. It's going to suck in the cool air from the front and cool off all your hard drives in there. You can see the the hinges on the side, very strong, sturdy construction, mind you. This is not going to break easily. It's meant to look like this to allow a lot of air airflow going through it, as you can see. Strong ribbon construction there. Nothing is going to detach itself easily, open up, break, uh, without uh, you know you dropping it from high altitude. I tell you, this is uh, solid. Here is the USB 3.0 and eSATA plugs at the back. Of course, you've got your power and the power switch is just above it. And uh, that's out of sight, so that way you don't accidentally touch it and turn it on or off um, with your foot or wherever it is that it might be on your desk. Th nothing much on the other side. You can see there those little um, brackets which are going to latch on to the hard drive itself. Okay, three and a half inch hard drives only in there. Remember that. And uh, well, the uh, door just opens and closes, pretty standard, nothing fancy out of the ordinary. The 120mm uh, LED fan can be replaced with aftermarket, comes with a nice um, removable dust filter. If I turn on the lighting uh, and the fan, you can see there it's up and running, very quiet. Okay, this is whisper quiet. It does not make any loud noises, so you're going to like that. Um, you can have, obviously, the LED off, no lighting and just have the cooling on the fan, that's it. Taking the uh, little latch out here, you can see it has the options for screws on either side, so you will have to attach it to your hard drive. I've already done that in the interest of time, and uh, you can see here it's already installed, and it's just a matter now of sliding the drive into the drive bay, and then just latching that lock into the lock position. That's it, easy. And you would do that with all four drives should you decide to buy four, right? You don't have to buy four. You can buy two and then later on get the other two. It's up to you, but it has the expansion capability. That's great. Once you have the hard drives in there, it'll be blue, all the LEDs, and it'll blink, of course, when there's activity going on from those hard drives. You can see the HDD2 where I just slid in that hard drive. And in Windows 10, you can see the J uh, Micron generic uh, SCSI uh, drive device. That's what it's detected and installed as. So you can see there the uh, drive that I just slid in there works great like a charm, expanding the capabilities of my machine. Now I have another uh, terabyte of space, but of course you can expand this up to 32 terabytes uh, should you decide to buy uh, four eight terabyte drives. Okay. Now this is compatible with a Mac, Linux, Windows, you name it, it will work. So there you have it. Excellent product from IC Doc. Comment below on this black vortex. And again, thank you for watching.